Hello guys, I will show you honest review of Samsung Galaxy Watch and its comparison with the Polar M600. So let's turn them on. Before two months I was searching for good everyday smartwatch and I have chosen Samsung Galaxy Watch over Apple Watch. The main reason for choosing Samsung uh, Galaxy Watch was the fact that it belongs to um, Android ecosystem while for the Apple Watch I would need to buy a new phone, really Apple? So this Galaxy Watch functions um, uh, on iPhone as well as on Samsung or, or any other Android phone, while the Apple Watch uh, functions only on iPhone. That was the main, uh, the main reason for me to buy this watch. Um, Overall, I'm satisfied with the Galaxy Watch. Uh, it has uh, a nice look, nice, uh, good quality. Um, I use it every day uh, for my job and for my leisure time. It has decent tracking functionality. It tracks distance uh, as you can see here, uh, there is a good tracking of steps, floors, calories, um, and GPS functions really well. Um, so it tracks distance, pace, speed, heart rate workout duration, calories burned, steps, floors, and the quality and the duration of night sleep, as you can see here. Ladder, stress level. Um, this barometer actually uh, doesn't work quite well. Uh, so, nice sleep record you should to leave it on your wrist while sleeping so however heart rate monitor sometimes stop during the exercise and that's the the main failure of this watch of this nice watch i will try to show you uh how how it stops uh Yesterday for me, it shows here that uh, uh, the watch measures actually my heart rate from 54 to 134. But when I go to um, when I go to uh, wait here and see the activity for two uh, for yesterday walking auto so you see um, uh, the time um, how uh, 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 kilometers calories the pace and you see the heart rate zone so it's moderate heart rate zone but uh, here uh, the heart rate a measurement should appear there is not that's because sometimes heart rate monitor actually uh, stop and you uh, get a wrong measurement so you see workout duration average pace average speed and maximum heart rate Um, 
So also I have noticed that Staps count is not quite good as some, sometimes it measures good the floors I pass but sometimes it fails to measure uh, floors. Step count is quite nice, quite, quite good actually this measurement of number of steps but this measurement of number of floors are um, um, Actually, it fails too, too many times. The battery is fascinating for regular use. It takes, um, uh, it lasts more than five days, but less than six days. Regular use means that I use it all day with continuous heart rate monitoring, and for up to two hours, I use. GPS and Wi-Fi, but I turn it off during the night. If everything is on and I use it all the day and night, I got more than three days, but less than four days. So um, the poor. Uh, what's the difference between these watches? Uh, uh, the main difference is that Polar M600 is the complete, um, completely different watch. It actually runs on um, Android operating system, uh, Wear operating system, and uh, now it it is updated to Wear OS uh, 2. Um, but um, although it's a smart watch, it's primarily a, a sport smart watch. So uh, sport is the main um, the main uh, benefit of this watch, while it also give, gives you some smart uh, functionality. Uh, for example, high heart rate monitoring is similar to HR10 and to medical devices for heart rate measurement. So it can be used as quite reliable, but not for medical purposes. On the other side, it looks sporty and it's too big. You see how, how fat is it compared to Samsung. Galaxy Watch. Um, um, and uh, it's too big for my shirt. So it is not watch for everyday use. It's a watch for sports. The battery lasts only uh, for two days. Out so faster. So, but you can count that it can last for two days compared to Samsung that can last for five days. And so the main um, characteristic of the Samsung is that it can be used all day, every day, for five days without the need for charging. Um, it has a decent step counting, but very clumsy uh, measurement of heart rate. Um, and on the contrary, this is mainly sport, wa sport watch, so you can use it when you do, uh, when you run, when you uh, walk, when you swim. Um, it has a decent GPS functionality, uh, a best HR monitoring among the smartwatches and uh, I would actually uh, in comparison when in conclusion I would uh, actually suggest both these watches um, as I use both uh, when swimming running or doing other exercises I would, uh, I would suggest using Polar M600 uh, and 
while you are at work or uh, uh, you just need watch, watch, regular watch and some uh, uh, measurements of your heart rate, but not uh, uh, but not exact measurements. Uh, you should use or you can use uh, the Galaxy Watch. I hope I help a bit to those who are considering buying either one of these watches. Thank you for watching. Keep track for more videos soon. Please subscribe.